like to offer you a warm welcome to Patrick Air Force Base and the Defense Equal Opportunity Management Institute and our ceremony here today honoring Mr. Ronald M. Joe as he relinquishes leadership to Captain Yolanda Y. Reagans as she assumes command of one of the best education, training, and research facilities in the world. We are pleased to have with us today our presiding official, Mr. Frederick E. Volrath, Principal Deputy, Assistant Secretary of Defense for Readiness and Force Management. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here today. Uh, Mr. Joe, Captain Riggins, distinguished guests, one and all. This is a very uh, honor, personal honor for me, and thank you very much for the opportunity to speak to you today. The distinctive accomplishments of Mr. Joe reflect great credit upon himself and the Department of Defense. Signed, Leon E. Panetta, Secretary of Defense. This has been one of the passions of my life. I don't think I would have come out of retirement uh, to do anything else but this. I've worked you hard, you've worked hard, but none of it could have been done without you. It is your accomplishment. And I say to you, thank you so very, very much. I also say to you, it's not over. It's your job to do what you do. Nobody else in the world, nobody else in the Department of Defense does what you do, is equipped to do what you do, has the expertise to do what you do. Lean forward. Help make readiness what it could be through your efforts and the things that you do to make this work. I love you, and there's nothing you can do about it. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the Diomi Change of Leadership and Assumption of Command Ceremony. Transfer of leadership authority is symbolized through passing of the guidon. Chief Barham begins the ceremony by passing the guidon to Mr. Joe. Mr. Joe will now pass the guide on to Mr. Volrath, signifying the honorable conclusion of his leadership. Mr. Volrath now hands the Diomi guide on to Captain Reagans, signifying the honorable transfer of leadership responsibility to her as Diomi's incoming commandant. Captain Reagans now returns the guide on to Chief Barham, completing the ceremony. Captain Reagans will now read her assumption of command orders. Attention to orders. By authority of Navy regulations, Captain Yolanda Y. Reagans assumes command of the Defense Equal Opportunity Management Institute, effective 8 June 2012, signed Captain Yolanda Y. Reagans, commanding. Ladies and gentlemen, the 14th Commandant of the Defense Equal Opportunity Management Institute, Captain Yolanda Reagans. I have not gotten to where I am in my naval career without the support of my family and some really good mentors and some extraordinarily good friends. I tell you what, I have been so blessed and I am so honored to, to be here. I've had the wonderful fortune of being here for about 10 months to learn a whole lot. And I know that I'm going to get smarter along the way and it's because of each and every one of you. You are magnificent. You are bright. You have so much vision. You have so much talent. And I am looking forward to uh, serving with you and working with, with all of you. Mr. Joe, I just wanted to uh, take the opportunity to just thank you for your leadership. Thank you for your counsel. Thank you for your sage advice. Thank you for taking me underneath your wing and literally sharing so much knowledge and, and, and depth and breadth of information about Diomi, its existence. And sir, I've, I've learned a lot and I look forward to uh, leading this organization. And so I thank everyone from the bottom of my heart for being here. I thank you for taking time to make this day special for both Mr. Joe and myself. And I look forward to working with you all in the future. 